Good morning, welcome to another Vlogmas. Um, this is day eight, I don't know. I am still, okay, this is so gross, but I'm still getting the sleep out of my eyes because it is 8.26, I woke up and walked Mochi, fed him, and now I am here at Elysian. I'm gonna start my Monday with a hike because that's what I did two weeks ago and then I ended my week last week with a hike here, so we're just gonna do it. Um, I didn't bring Mochi this time because I do wanna get it over with pretty quickly. Um, and Mochi likes to sniff and take his sweet time. So he already got a walk this morning. Um, I need to be home by 10 because my best friend Kira is doing a reading of her play over Zoom and I wanna watch. So I'm gonna leave you here in the car. I'm not gonna take you along today because I'm gonna really be centered in myself and not distracted. But I will talk to you when I get back from this hike. It is a very, very gloomy day. So I'm excited to get my, my blood pumping and get a little warm because it is quite chilly. So, is she wearing Buff Bunny? Oh no, I thought she was. All right, catch up with you after the hike. Hello, I'm back from the hike. It was only like 30 or 40 minutes because I was moving at a good pace. I have a little bit of energy and some time before this play reading. So I'm gonna do Cassie Ho from Blogilates. Uh, her new video, it's a Christmas workout, like to Christmas music, and I feel like I feel in the spirit, and it's only 15 minutes, I think, so might as well try it. Um, so I'm gonna use the rest of my energy to do that right now. watching some ASMR. Um, about an hour ago, I watched Kira's play reading, which was really cool over Zoom. And while I watched that, I had my leftover pesto from yesterday, my, my pesto pasta with chicken. And I'm having some hot cocoa because I mix some of my um, supplemental powder in there and it really masks the flavor. So I usually have hot cocoa or hot tea in the morning to do that. So yeah, I am currently uploading Vlogmas day seven, which is, um, a Whole Foods grocery haul and um, cooking gluten-free pesto pasta. If you saw day seven, then you've seen it. Um, you know what leftovers I'm talking about. If you haven't, go check it out. Go check out day seven. I love grocery hauls. And I, it's not often that I go to Whole Foods and get a bunch of stuff, so it's fun. Go check it out. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna take a shower and then get ready because I need to film an unboxing today. So excited about it. I have the box, it's it's a fragrance, first impressions, blind buys, unboxing, and I am just itching to see what's in the box. But the box came at like 7 or 8 p.m. yesterday, randomly, I don't know what mail service it was, but I was dying to open it, but I thought, no, wait until the morning. So, gonna shower and um, get into, probably sweats, but some clothes that are not hiking clothes, and start my filming portion of the day. Hello, I just filmed my fragrance buy, 
first impressions, unboxing, haul, whatever you want to call it. I cannot wait for that to go up because I am psyched about these fragrances and my reaction to one in particular is maybe irrational. I don't care. Um, so now I think I'm going to start editing that. Tidy up, I guess. <laughs> I have kind of a fragrance mess around me, but that's the way we like to do it over here. I'm getting a little hungry too, so I might make myself one of those umami burgers and some root fries. Maybe I'll start making that now. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna start editing that haul video and uh, get to work on that. All right, I just made my Vlogmas for today live. I'm filming my little unboxing and I'm having some dinner now. I'm gonna take a chill pill, have some early dinner, late lunch, I don't know, it's 3.42, I just felt like eating. These are the little frozen fries that I got from Whole Foods. They taste just like veggie chips, but in fry form. So I'm glad I have ketchup and mustard to add a little flavor. And then I have some leftover white rice and I put a chicken breast in the oven with some of that coconut mango sauce that I also got from Trader, uh, from Whole Foods. Did I say Trader Joe's? Whole Foods, it's all from Whole Foods. And it's like keto, gluten-free, paleo friendly, whatever, but I'm psyched because mango coconut, so. And let me just try a bite before I enjoy the rest of my dinner and watch Girlfriends, of course, because I'm the most predictable. Let's see what this tastes like. And I think this is a Costa Rican company, actually. I dated a Costa Rican guy once. Oh, he was gorgeous. That's really good. That kind of reminds me of Thai curry. That's really, really good. Or maybe Indian. I can't put my finger on it, but that's really good. All right. I'm going to eat. Catch you later. Uh, all right, I think I'm about to end the vlog here. I know this wasn't that exciting, but listen, more exciting things are coming and some days are just not that thrilling. But I did get three packages today and I wanna open them and show you what I got. So I have one package from Amazon that I'm pretty sure I know this is uh, dog shampoo, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. Not quite dinner time yet, Mochi. You gotta wait a couple more minutes. So this is Tropiclean two-in-one pet shampoo and conditioner, papaya and coconut. I was just hoping for something that would make, it smells really good, that would make him smell a little bit better. The oatmeal one is like, I don't know. I want something a little more that will make him smell really clean. So we'll see about that. Then I got a package from Parade, which is an underwear brand that I started not working with because we haven't done any sponsored content or anything, but they, I somehow got on their PR list and I guess they sent me something new. I can't wait, oh my God, I'm pretty sure this is their juicy. <gasps> I just saw this on Instagram today that they did a collaboration with Juicy Couture and I was like, dang, I wish I could work with them on that. <gasps> oh my God, I used to love Juicy Couture. <gasps> this is huge for them, oh my God. Look how awesome, oh my goodness. Thanks Parade for sending this to me, geez. It's not every day that I get cool PR packages like this, okay? Oh my goodness. All right, so we have a, a velour pouch, classic juicy. Oh, this is throwing me back to the good old days. Okay. I know people are gonna be like, do an underwear try on, but maybe I will, TBH. Oh, we have mesh that say juicy, navy, and like baby blue. I already have some of their, um, I already have some of their mesh, mesh underwear and it is so comfortable, you'd be surprised. It is like not fishnetty material, it's really stretchy. It's so, so comfortable. So there's that. And boy shorts, oh my God, these are cute. Oh, I'm so gonna do a shoot in these later this week to post to my grid on Instagram. Ooh, okay. Love these, these look a little bit cheeky and they have like paneling, so part of it is sheer. The whole back is sheer and the front part of it is. I love this color. And then what is this? We have a little parade. What's this about? Oh my gosh, no way. <gasps> oh! Oh my gosh, this is so generous. I'm so shook. Live free, wear juicy. Oh my God, this is too cute. I am definitely gonna do like, okay, that looks crazy, but 
definitely gonna like do a little pirate. Oh, <sighs> that just made my day. I had no idea that was coming in the mail. Thank you, Parade. Oh my God. And then I am really excited because there is a new fragrance company that sent me some of their fragrances and I'm gonna review them later this week. Uh, the company is Michael Malul. Malul. I had never heard of this brand before, but they hit me up. They're like, we like your videos. We'd love to have you try a few of our fragrances. I'm like, Zuh. So they sent me a package and it's very much appreciated. I'm sorry, I have to take the sweatshirt off. It's burning in here because I had the heat on and then it just got to be too much. But it's a sports bra, so we're fine. Okay, so anyway, in this package, Yay, we have no extra plastic in here. I love that. You guys, my apartment is suddenly a mess. This is insane. All right, we got this box. I don't know what's in this. They have one fragrance with can the word candy in the name, and I am very intrigued to try it because I like sweet and I like Prada candy, so. Ooh, oh my God, look at this. Oh, samples on samples. What the heck? Oh my gosh, I feel like they sent me like every one of their fragrances. Okay, I am too excited to try all of these. Oh my gosh, okay, well that's gonna be awesome. Including some men's fragrance, so that's good. And then 173 Candy and 144 Bloom. So yeah, I'm gonna do a full review, but in candy, uh, the notes are sheer citrus, quince, jasmine, rose, freesia, amber, vanilla, musk, mosswood. And in bloom, black currant, pear, raspberry, apricot, rose, jasmine, lily, peony, amber, musk, and sandalwood. I want to try candy. What pretty minimal packaging. Wow. Okay. <gasps> Do I love it already? Oh my God. <laughs> I have just had crazy fragrance luck lately. The okay, well I don't wanna spoil it cause I will be doing a review, but if, if a date this weekend happens, I know what I'm wearing. Is someone coming up my stairs? Yes, I just hid from someone coming up my stairs potentially. Um, yeah, if I, if we have a date scheduled this weekend, I think I know what I'm gonna wear. Um, I'm gonna end this vlog here because I have acting class tonight in two hours. My apartment is officially a mess. So I need to address that so that I am not stressed out and unfocused during acting class. Um, yeah, I'm gonna end this here. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I know this wasn't that crazy but uh, that's just how some days be, you know? Uh, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Love you so much. Mwah. Bye, guys.